Hello, this is Baron, and if you're single and are feeling down about your love life and would like to figure out a way to completely transform this over the next five days, stick around because I'm going to show you how to do just that on my episode today. Hello, this is Baron. Welcome to your great life to be.com. Today is another edition of Get the Love You Crave. Super pumped today because if you're feeling down, if you're feeling disappointed, if you're feeling like your love life is not progressing at the level you want to, if you're feeling like giving up, I'm going to be sharing with you a five-step program, super simple but incredibly powerful, to transform, to give your life, love life a 180 from feeling like crap to feeling a great sense of aliveness, fulfillment, passion, progress, and hope about the possibilities that you have on your days, months, and weeks ahead. And the best thing is you, you don't need a month for this. You don't need a year for this. All you need is five conscious days of stepping into this and doing it with giving it your all. So number one is get moving again. So day number one, your focus will be massively adding more movement to your life. And what that means is I want you to, first of all, if you're not exercising daily, I want you to start that, those, these five days, you're going to move, you're going to exercise. And I don't want you to kill yourself exercising, but I do want you to maybe take some moment in the morning, maybe 15 minutes, 20 minutes, half an hour, if you can do that. Some moment in, in before, I mean, after dinner, before dinner, maybe 10, 15 minutes of movement. Movement, okay? I also want you to incorporate a couple of dance routines in the day. You heard me right, dance routines. So in the morning when you wake up, 30 minutes of dancing, shaking your ass, being alive, jumping, put your headset on, crank the volume up, and really do this with full intensity. You're going to start breaking the pattern of moving with depressive moves and starting to move with quality, aliveness producing moves, which will open up your mind, your heart, and give you access to so many much more tools that you're not having access to right now because you're feeling down. So that's day number one. Day number two, you're going to do the same thing as day number one, which means you add extra movement, you add exercise, ideally a couple times a day, if a little brief effect, I mean 15 minutes in the morning, 15 minutes in the evening, or at least 30 minutes in the morning, and then you're going to add uh, the dancing and you're gonna do gratitude. Three minutes a day, that's all I'm asking. The earlier the better, because it affects your entire day, but close your eyes, put your hands on your heart, and focus not on thinking, but feeling great moments of your life. So you start imagining, let's say you're sitting in a movie theater and you're watching a movie of your life, and you start seeing great moments. You start seeing the moment where you first kissed someone, the first time that you received your, your first paycheck, for example, uh, people who've loved you deeply in your life, best friends who've entered your life, great moments, you start stacking them one on top of the other and you start feeling them. You can turn on music if that makes it easier for you to get the emotion. But once you start feeling so grateful that you start feeling almost teary-eyed, you may even cry doing this, you've got the resonance of gratitude, which is one of the most powerful essences and moments and virtues to step into when you want to change from feeling bad to feeling excited again. So that's day number two. Day number three, you're going to do those same things, but you're adding one more thing, which is reconnect to your strengths. Reconnect to your strengths means partly is connecting to your self-love connecting to loving yourself, connecting to recognizing the things that you already do in your life, the things about you that make you unique, things about you that make you special, the things about you that make you beautiful and sexy, the part of your body that you love most, the qualities that you bring to your life. So you're going to write a long list of things. Just non I mean, write down for 10 minutes if you, if you can, like nonstop. Play some cool music if it makes it easier. You're going to write down all the qualities, all the strengths, all the things you bring as gifts to the world to start focusing again on that part of loving yourself, which for the most part, when you're feeling down, is criticizing yourself, is feeling like you are, you're not enough, you're not as beautiful, you're not as sexy. I want you to reconnect to how amazing you are and remember to not be very, uh, what's the word? I mean, I want you to be very generous. I don't want you to be stingy with this list. Be very generous with, with your list. That's day number three. Day number four, I want you to focus on smile. Hope you're writing these things down. Day number four is smiling. So what you're gonna do is, in addition to the movement and dancing, in addition to the gratitude, in addition to the focusing on your strengths, which means you already have the list, all you have to do is read the list now, you don't have to rewrite it. But day number four is I want you to focus on smiling. So at least four or five times a day, you're going to smile when before you would have just been, have a neutral face, excited, I'm down and about. You're gonna smile. You're gonna be conscious about your smile and you're going to see not just how amazing it feels to do this, but how amazing it feels for some people. And I say some people because the measurement of your smiling will not be 
whether the people that you smile to smile back, because there's some people who are pretty miserable and they're not gonna smile, they're gonna think you're weird. That's okay, you're not doing it for them to smile back, but some people are gonna think, you know what? I'm so thankful that this beautiful human being, this beautiful woman is smiling at me, so that warms my heart, and they'll have no other option but unconsciously just naturally smile back at you, and it's gonna feel really good inside. So that's day number four. Focus on smiling at least four or five times a day to strangers, to yourself in the mirror, to people you love, I mean, but four or five times a day at the minimum. If you can do 10, 20 times, even better. Day number five. That's where you put it all to practice. You're going to connect with more men. That's the day where you're going to do something fun, you're gonna dress up, you're going to feel confident, you're gonna go outside of your natural environment, and you're going to use all the things you've practiced from more aliveness to more smiles to connect with more men. And I don't want you to have dates basically on that day. All I want you to do is connect with more men, smile at more men, flirt with more men, communicate, start conversations, but know that when you're the kind of woman who creates this kind of inner fire, and you put it in the outside world and you connect with people, you get some pretty powerful results. And again, the measurement for this will not be how many people ask for your number, it will be were you able to do it? Did you have the guts to do it? So now you might be thinking, well, that's a lot, Bern. You're asking me to do all these things and I don't have time. Here's the thing. If your love life sucks right now, if you're feeling so sad, if you're feeling depressed, if you're feeling like this thing is not going anywhere, this is an incredibly small price to pay to get a 180 on the momentum of your love life. So as challenging as it might seem, the rewards on the other end are getting that kind of woman that every single man wants to connect with. I hope you find this helpful, useful, insightful in some way. If you do, I'm going to ask you to do three things. Number one, click like on this video. Number two, subscribe to my channel. Number three, if you do nothing else, I want you to, on the description box of this video, uh, there's gonna be a link. Also on the corner here, there's gonna be a little button that shows up that is gonna allow you to subscribe to my free live webinar where I'm going to be showing you a three-step process, a blueprint, to find your soulmate in 90 days or less. Super powerful stuff and it's free. If you have any questions for me, place a comment on any of my videos, including this one, and I'll reply to it personally. Thank you so much for connecting with me. As always, I challenge you to live a full and a conscious life.